Every year, Stolt Tankers recognizes one very special team who have distinguished themselves for their commitment to health and safety, their efficiency, and the quality of service delivered to customers. In 2017, that accolade went to Stolt Glory. We went on board to experience a day in the life of the Stolt Glory team. This is their story. Hundred hours. Fire drill on the deck of Stolt Glory. A good opportunity for the chief officer to discuss and practice safety procedures with the crew. The most dangerous places on the ship protected this flooding line, yeah? flooding system. First, we need to ask the bridge for permission. When it's granted, open up. Now you can see the big difference between trained guys who are already a long time on board and new joining guys. And of course, well-trained people, they are most effective in such situations. On Stolt Glory, like all Stolt tankers, regular training helps keep the crew and ship safe. Okay, good morning, guys. Yeah, good morning. So we have today a normal job, so we have expected tomorrow and maybe tonight we're going for shifting from the anchor to Pasir Gudang to port. In the engine room, the second engineer is briefing his team before the arrival in the busy shipping port of Pasir Gudang. Everyone understands their role. Some parts need to be cleaned. Machines need to be maintained. A routine day. But complications are about to happen. An oil leak has been discovered on one of the engines. The second engineer immediately goes down to the engine room to take a look. Thankfully, it's nothing serious, just a small leak from a loose washer. Regardless, the crew must still follow the necessary protocols. The engine is stopped so repairs can be done. The cause of the leak is swiftly fixed. In the control room, the chief officer is making final checks before the ship receives cargo. So, 28 things. Every one of them it's simple, but very, very effective, yeah? So everything I can get here. Level, temperature sensors, and pressure. What do you think This is creamier. This is some kind of fatty acid. Required high temperatures during the voyage. So we're going to use our heating system to keep it warm all the time. On the deck, the crew needs to check the tanks are clean. Before we wash, take first that uh, there's no cargo remain on the tank because uh, sometimes we discharge uh, partial cargo. That's a big mistake when you wash the tank with the cargo inside. Always be prepared. The following morning, Stolt Glory has safely moored in Pasir Gudang port, ready to start the loading process. For the crew, it's mission accomplished. Stall glory, score it highly, health and safety. A lot of parameters was taken into account, but first of all, it was hard work of all crew. Ship of the year, it's not about ships at all, it's about people. When the best crew assembling in one place, on one ship, 
everything possible.